Hello guys, hope everybody is fine and doing good. In this, uh, today I'm going to make a video about HGV, how to become HGV driver in the UK. And in this video, I would like to explain each and everything and the procedure. I will explain that how you can become a HGV driver in the UK and from the beginning. So please subscribe my YouTube channel and let's start about this. So the very first thing is that in order to become HGV driver in the UK, you need to have your car license category B, but keep in your mind you must have a manual driving license. If you have automatic driving license, you will not get entitlement. So you must have manual category B driving license in order to get or in order to make HGV license. So what is the procedure? The very first thing is you have to do is you need to go on Google and order two form, what is called D2 and one is called D4. So D2 form is for yourself. You have to put your basic details, your name, address, your driving license number, if you have any convictions, any eyesight related questions, you have to uh, fill out that very carefully. And uh, the D4 form is called medical form. You can't fill that, that is not for you. You need to take to the doctor. Every doctor cannot do that, but you need to find, if you go on Google and put your postcode, then you will be able to find on Google that. Uh, if is there any doctor nearby who is doing HGV or uh, manly, you know, mostly uh, the taxi drive and taxi badge medical, uh, those doctors who do taxi medicals, they can also do or they also try to do the HGV as well. They will charge you obviously 50 pound or 60 pound. <coughs> so first you fill D2 form and after that you fill out, uh, you take D4 form to the doctor and get it done from the doctor. After that, you have to send D2 and D4 form together with your driving license to DVLA. Where you have to send, do not send just uh, the first result you see on Google or uh, anywhere the results you see on the form. Do not send your DVLA, do not send your form to that address that is mentioned on application form. So what you do is, in order to find the correct address, you need to go on Google and type where to send your D2 and D4 HGV driving application forms. So there you will see Google, the first result you will see on Google, uh, or you can get the result on, you can get the correct address on a DVLA official website as well. Once you send there, you will get your entitlement back. You will get your driving license with the entitlement that, okay, you are able to take your driving, uh, you, you can start your uh, practical lessons and you can also book your theory. So once you get your driving license back from DVLA with the entitlement, you can go on Google and again, the way you book your theory test for your car driving license, with the same procedure, you can book your theory test for HGV. And after that, what you can do is you, uh, once you pass your theory, then you have to pass another small test that is called uh, case study and uh, hazard perception. So you have to get ready yourself uh, through the practice of hazards and uh, theory. Obviously, you have to buy this book. Buy this book. I bought this book from eBay. It cost me £15. You can get maybe cheaper from Facebook, but sometimes it is very far. People are selling. So I bought this from eBay so you can get it anywhere you feel convenient or cheap. You can get it from Amazon, from eBay or from other bookstore shops. So this is the book. You have to read this book from uh, A to Z and you can also do the practice on apps. You can purchase the app and uh, once you are ready for your theory test, then you can go for it and after passing your theory test hazard perception and case study then you would be able to join the school so you must have to join the school the school charge you about 1200 to 14 or 1500 pounds and they will give you practical training about 14 to 18 hours depends and uh, then you would be ready for your practical test practical exam and if you pass your practical exam before you go for practical exam, the government introduced new reforms about HGV driving license is that before reforms, the law was this that you must have to pass class two and after that you can go for class one that is called C plus E as well. But now the new rules allow you that you can take training directly for C plus E class one or 
if you want you can make class 2 if you want you can directly make class 1 c plus c driving license so it is entirely your choice some people who feel very confident they go for class 1 because if they get class 1 they can also drive rigid lorry and the bigger lorry definitely but some people they may be thinking that the rigid lorry is fine for them so they simply go for class 2 so government given you both options you can go for direct class 1 or you can go for class 2 but if you go directly for class 2 and after some time if you have interest that you want to go for class 1 then you don't need to pass any theory test or you do not do you don't need to do any medical or anything but you have to prepare yourself for class 1 uh, bigger lorry uh, practical exam so you might have to pay a school who will give you uh, practical training for class 1 so the ideal situation is definitely go for class 1 because you have this opportunity maybe it's for limited time and <clears throat> let's go back again in the beginning because i think that uh, i have missed few things but uh, not much so your medical the one you get it done from the doctor is valid only for four months try not to waste those four months otherwise you will have to get your new medical done from the doctor will charge you again 50 to 60 pounds so keep in your mind you must send your application form with medical form to the dvla within four months before your medical is expired because you need to send both together and uh, about your uh, how to fill the form i have already put one video how to fill out uh hgv cloud d2 uh, form so i have uh, covered almost everything because there is a confusion that what entitlement you can get basically the questions are a bit logical but i have made made video about how to fill out the form complete form uh, d2 form including picture uh, requirements if, if who need the pictures why they need the picture and uh, what are the conditions if you already got photo card license and I have covered each and everything on that video. So if you go on my uh, videos, if you scroll back, you will see definitely a video that is uh, about how to fill out D2 form. So why I have interest in the G uh, HGV in uh, this field because I work as a security guard in uh, factories. So there I meet uh, many heavy drivers and I see their lifestyle. Before it used to be very difficult and not very very kind of something that uh, was attract uh, attractive for everybody but now after brexit it has become very uh, high in demand good in pay and i think it is a secure job and you can life uh, you can work all your life as long as you drive safe as long as you don't break the rules regulations of the traffic laws and uh, you stick with the terms and conditions so I think it is a secure job and you can enjoy your uh, secure job. So if you like this video, just uh, try to subscribe my YouTube channel, please. And if you got any question in your mind, don't, don't hesitate. You can leave a comment. So I will try my best to address that very question. Thank you very much.